Greg from Vulture here with this week's tip of the week. What I wanted to show is something we played around with last season, end of last season. So your traditional way is to use the magnets that we supply, tie it on a string, tie it to your flag. This is an option that we've been playing around with just using stronger magnets. So I have a stronger magnet here. You can look at it and see it's basically uh, stuck to the flag. I actually just put some tape around it just to ensure it stays on even better. Um, but you can see there's no physical contact from the magnet to the sensor. That's nice because you don't have to worry about having that actual surface area on the sensor. And when the flag goes up, you don't have to worry about, you know, sometimes your string can wrap all around the flag. So you'll see the magnets nice and stationary on here. It's set on the flag. Um, I actually have the sensor mounted here because I have a shorter flag. I'm gonna explain why I have a short flag here in a little bit but you could just as easily have the sensor sitting over here. Um, and in this case, I just have it Velcroed on. So there's tons of different ways that you could do it, but the whole purpose of this tip of the week is to show, hey, you could just go pick up any stronger magnet. Maybe we'll supply some if enough people are interested. Um, and you just need to make sure that the magnet's strong enough to trigger the sensor. The last thing I want to show is something I played around with last year at Lake of the Woods. So you'll see I modified a little polar tip up here, cut it back so it fits in their diagonal. Um, I actually put one of those little Zippo heaters in the corner over here, a little bit of insulation on the top, and this worked really well. Something I could close up at night, kept my hole nice and uh, open throughout the night, and you know I didn't have to worry about snow drifting in my hole and whatnot. So you can see here I modified the flag, cut it back a little bit. That's why this tip-up looks the way it does, um, and I played around. I've used the stronger magnet so I didn't have a line on there. Um, when it actually closes up, it's nice and sealed, and when it goes off, the flag is long and uh, short enough that it actually goes off. Got the alarm here. All I had to do is open this up every time I got a flag. Good to go. Pretty cool idea. Worked great.